channel ladies and I'm here today to do a review on this Ali Moda AliExpress Brazilian curly hair that I purchased. I purchased an 18, 20, 22, and 24 inch and I did not purchase a closure. I did construct these bundles onto a full wig, a dome cap, and I did do the flip over method. I slightly altered it a little bit so I will include a clip of that. I sew the first track, I cut it, and then I flip that one over. I then sew the next one, and I sew at a diagonal angle, so I sew them slanted. I do not sew them straight across like most people do. I sew them slanted so that my flip over will go in a sideways direction. So I cut that, flip that one over, sew the next one diagonally, flip that one over, So that one diagonally, flip that one over. So, as you can see, it gives you a different volume. It's like slanted. So you can wear it as if you had this part gelled back and flipped over, or you can just wear it to the side. Alright ladies, and I just close it up the way everyone closes their flip over method with sewing a couple tracks across. And here is the finished look. A lot of volume at the top. It can be brought to the front and cut into bangs whatever you really want to do so I would definitely say that I like this hair um, I purchased this hair back in August and it took about four to five days to receive when I received the hair it did not have an odor it was not wet it came in four individual plastic wrappers listed with the lengths on them like it normally comes I did wash the hair I washed it and then I deep conditioned it Put it in the microwave for about a minute when i rinsed out the hair it was extremely soft it still had the same curl pattern it um, did not rinse out any color when i washed it so i did go back and dye the hair black it did take the color well it did not dry the hair out it did not alter the curl pattern in any way it was great so i did construct my a full wig and I did sew it onto my head. The only part that I have left out is this little triangle shaped amount of hair um, just so I can cover the beginning of my wig. I left out a tiny itty bitty amount of hair and intertwined it with a few of the curls so it could blend. So this hair you guys I have had since August. I have not consistently worn it uh, since August till March, um, but I have worn it a couple times. I've put it on, then worn it for about two weeks and then taken it off and worn something else. But um, it has lasted great. It's still soft. The curls are defined. I just washed it. So uh, this is its natural state. No product on it. It's just water. I did not condition it. So it's a little frizzy. But other than that, it's beautiful. It's really, really soft. It's not heavy at all. Um, I love, love, love this hair. So if you are a fan of curly hair, you know curly hair sheds, curly hair tangles, and curly hair mats. That's the reality of curly hair. 
but if you can overlook that you will have some beautiful hair this hair i pay a total of 199 for to receive four bundles at longer lengths is a very good deal if you're one of the type of people who likes to brush through your curly hair this may not be the hair for you this hair it tends to uh not at the end if you try to brush through it with like a big tooth comb brush um, you can brush it as in teasing it to make it a little bit bigger, which is what I like to do. It's going to create frizz, so you might have to spray it uh, with your water bottle or you might have to use Care Care Curling Defining Custard, which I absolutely love. It tames the curl and it's lightweight and it smells wonderful. So you might have to use a product to tame the curl after you try to brush through it. But I definitely would not recommend you trying to get the comb through the actual tendrils of the hair. It's not going to be a good result. You might end up breaking a lot of the hair cuticles. So I definitely wouldn't recommend that. Um, for the back, of course, it does tangle and mat the worst back here. Um, I do have a couple pieces that are a little bit shorter because they've broken off because they've tangled a little bit. Um, but if you do want to like separate your hair, you do have to wet it first and then pull it apart from the bottom. So you have to start at the bottom and work your way up. If you don't, you're going to experience really bad breakage. And as you can see, like it's still kind of tangled and, but it will separate. You just have to do it bit by bit or else you will break the entire rest of the end off. It is a little tedious when um, it comes to separating it, trying to make it bigger um, by separating the curls. You can always fluff it. You can always kind of tease it a little bit just to make it look a little bigger because I love big curly hair. You can tease it as much as you think you need to, but um, yeah, you can run your fingers through it somewhat. You can't just comb through it just like straight hair because of course you're gonna get, you know, shedding. You're gonna get a few snatches through. Um, it does shed every time I run my hand through it. Not every day, every time I run my hand through it, I have shedding. So, um, but for me, I expect that. So it doesn't bother me that much. Um, I just know if I want curly hair, that's just something I'm gonna have to deal with. But I, you know, I love this hair. I love how it looks. I get compliments on it all the time. So uh, if you're looking for something that's not very expensive, but will provide you with a great look for a decent amount of time, I would definitely recommend this company. Um, you don't have to get a closure. If you would like to get a closure, you can, but you can just do the flip over method. You don't have to have that part, especially if you're natural. It will be a little bit difficult to blend your hair. I am natural. I have 4C hair so the texture of my hair is not agreeable at all with this hair but because i left such a small amount out it doesn't really cause a big conflict so if you did want to leave just a tiny bit of your hair out you could roll it to make it blend better i was a little lazy so i didn't really uh do that i kind of just slicked some gel on it and intertwined it into the hair and uh that pretty much worked also so like I said, you guys, definitely recommend this hair uh, if you like curly hair that's not too expensive and will last you a decent amount of time. If you're looking for something that you can brush through, this is not the hair for you. So let me know what you guys think. Check out a few of my other videos. I have a video on crochet braids and I also have a few makeup tutorials, including an eyebrow tutorial. So subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and on Facebook. My name is DeAndrea Renee on there. And on Snapchat, my name is DeAndrea underscore Renee. Thanks for watching. See you guys later.